all right what's going on guys welcome back to the channel my name is robert thank you for tuning in today i wanted to throw a quick video together to talk about the upcoming yeezy 700 mnvn phosphor that is dropping june 13th that's tomorrow monday for the u.s retail price of 220 dollars i figured let's go ahead and talk about it real quick i'll give you my thoughts on the shoe let you know whether or not i'm gonna pick it up um and just want to thank all of y'all for tuning in today man a lot of you guys are really like this type of video that i dropped for the easy gap balenciaga um after that release i did kind of an impressions video where i talked about each of the items and i actually kind of like that format so we're going to do that here today um, so let's go ahead and get started. So like I mentioned, this shoe, the Phosphor 700 MNV, MNVN Phosphor is dropping tomorrow, June 13th. Now, um, at the time of this video, you obviously, as you can see here, it will be launching on Confirmed. It is a Q drop. Now that drop starts at, let me get the time right for you guys here. Um, I think it's around 11 a.m. Let me just double check here. Um, let's see, it starts, uh, yeah, 11 a.m. Eastern. So. Um, it will be starting then for those who are not familiar basically it's like just a line similar to what they do on Yeezy supply kind of um, I've had you know mixed luck with the uh, Q drops in the past and I'm not quite sure how they determine which shoes have a Q drop versus the draw that we typically see um, I've been able to like I said to kind of you know grab a few shoes via the Q drop the only issues I've encountered is sometimes when I'm actually sitting in that drop I may, you know, you get this uh, message saying like to not leave the screen, um, but I ended up sitting there very long and I ended up leaving and, I, and once I tried to come back in, I was let right in. But by that time, most of the shoes were gone. So I'm not sure if that was an error going on, but basically get in line, be ready by 11 a.m. Eastern tomorrow and hopefully you have good luck. So the 700 MNVN Phosphor may look very similar to you because this shoe actually did drop a similar version it was like the first mnvn to drop but it had a black midsole and basically on this one this new iteration that drops tomorrow it is the same color but it is completely laceless and obviously as you can see it's the first mnvn that has a white midsole all the other mnvns have a black midsole um, and as I mentioned the laces here, we have some other pictures that are a little bit larger than this that I'll show you, but we're just on this page right now. Um, yeah, so I'm excited for this shoe actually. I'm gonna definitely go for it. Um, if you guys watch any of my MNVN videos I've dropped, I told you and I meant what I said. It's quickly becoming one of my favorite Yeezys because it's pretty comfortable and it's easy to put on. Slip on shoe, you know, can't beat it. And it's like, you know, pretty good for all day wear, I would say. Um, but yeah, I'm definitely going for it. Looks like this one actually does have a pull tab on the back too, so that's new. So you got a white midsole, you got a pull tab now, and it's completely laceless. So that's what's new with this one. Um, just really quick, as I was starting to make this video, I noticed that these 380s were here. Now I heard that these were actually restocking, but I didn't really check my phone at the time. And I mean, I saw that a tweet went out, they were just, they were gonna be available, but I wasn't like checking the Adidas app and everything, looking for the shoe. But I see, that these are actually sitting here. Let's take a look and see what sizes they have. Um, let's see here. Um, pretty much a full size run here. Yeah, for the uh, Onyx. Um, I will say, um, this is a nice colorway. I gotta be real with y'all. Um, I'm surprised, well, I'm not surprised. The 380 is not super popular with a lot of consumers, but if you had to grab one, I would say um, go with the 380. And for me personally, you can wear a half size up, but I go full size up in mine. I know it's kind of off topic, but I figured why it's here, we'll go ahead and talk about it. Now, if you let this 380 sit right here, I don't know what you're doing. I dropped a video for this one a while ago, and I said this is like, for me, like probably top, top three or top five 380s to drop, period. This shoe is fire. It glows all over, if I remember correctly. Super fire colorway, all white, just a clean shoe, man. I don't know why people don't like this one because if i had to get one 380 it'd be this or maybe the alien pair but um yeah or the blue alien like all those are fire man but that that calcite glow don't sleep on it i you heard it here first i'm telling you right now they've got four they got a few sizes left here so go ahead and check it out but back to the mnvn phosphor we talked about the adidas release they will be on easy supply as well here's another image of them and you see they have it listed as true to size did adidas have that you don't see it on this page, but um, Yeezy Supply, I, I'm, I like the fact that they're starting to give you some advice on the sizing. Now, 
my personal advice on sizing for this shoe if it is anything like the geode or the metallic that released last year um i would say you can go true to size or half size up um i actually got both of those shoes and i dropped videos for them i think it was back in december and I did mention that I felt like that was one of the first Yeezys that was honestly true to size because I picked up my nine and a half, which is a half size up, and they actually fit pretty. I had more room in the toe box than I expected because most of the time in 700, if I get like a nine and a half, it usually almost fits kind of like a nine. It's, it's a little bit smaller lengthwise. But in these new MNVNs, I don't know if they tweak the sizing or whatever, but they do fit okay. What I am kind of worried about is, you know, these don't have laces. You can't really tighten them up. So I'm debating going with the true nine um, just so they won't slip. Honestly, though, I'm going to go with, I'm going to go for a nine and a half. Hopefully I get them, y'all. Wish me luck. Um, I'm going with my usual size, but just want to call that out. So true to size right here. Let's check out sneaker news over here. Um, I pulled this up. You can see there are several other places that looks like they're getting the shoes as well. Um, just wanted to take a look at some of these uh, images here, like, a little bit more close up. Just this color is nice, man. The Phosphor is one of my favorite colorways of the 700 MNVN. I don't actually own that OG model um, because it was almost, you know, pretty much virtually impossible to get when they first dropped. But now, of course, everybody likes that shoe um, or they seem to like it. I hope that the hype continues to be non-existent on the mnvns okay now here's a look at the front of the shoe as you can see laceless i kind of like this the way it looks it's kind of sleek you know simple vibe to it pretty fire you can see you got the pull tab at the back it appears to be 3m on that pull tab i'm assuming because it looks like this gray area back here and as always you got the 3m right here on these little stripes or whatever little accents here on the side of the toe top down view i do like this top down view that looks super fire uh the no lace thing i'm kind of liking it man I, I think this actually looks pretty good like i said i hope i can get this pair man this phosphor colorway is super nice um and here's a look at the sole so you got your standard 700 outsole you got the black sole here with the white you know midsole you see your boost there so that's pretty standard i think for um you know the 700 so uh that's the 700 MNVN Phosphor dropping tomorrow, guys. Comment down below and let me know if you guys are actually picking this up um, and what you think of the shoe. Hopefully, I get a pair and I can get them in hand and get them on the channel, but we'll see if, you know, the Adidas app is good to me tomorrow. But, um, yeah, guys, I uh, just wanted to uh, create this video for you. Like I said, get it up here. Talk about this shoe because, you know, it seems to be a pretty popular release happen happening uh, here uh, tomorrow. So, um, I thank all of you for watching, man. Thank you for all the support. Uh, appreciate, you know, watching the video, all that good stuff. Please drop a like on it and subscribe to the channel if you have not already. Again, thank you, and I'll see you next time.